Well, hello everyone and welcome back to Played Up. I'm getting set up here, but I figured I'd jump on and talk to you guys in the meantime. Uh, this won't fit having four tables here. This title is called A Job Well Done. I don't like that. We're going to name this the Outback Steakhouse. You know why? Because we're doing steak today, everybody. I haven't done steak in a while. Uh, I don't even know the last time, honestly, that I did steak. But we're going to set up here. Um, i got to get my table set up properly. Turn this one off. Those ones, other ones are fine like that. What I'll do is I'll put a I'll put a thing here, a table. I want to get everything set up. Now, steaks are, are very much, you cook them to order. Like there's not much, there's not a huge amount of prep to do. Um, at least not yet. I mean, if you start having things like blueprint cabinets and, and all that, well, yeah, then sure, of course. But we don't have blueprint cabinets, and we start out with what are we? Oh, sorry, guys. And I'm bringing you along for my li a little bit of my setup, just to show you how I set things up. Now we have way too many of everything here because, uh, yeah, we have way too much of everything. So I'm gonna try to set things up a little bit, so I don't have to mess with it too much as we continue. I'm probably gonna start right here. Like, there's no reason to have a bigger uh, area at this point. Now, if um, yeah, I guess I could adjust that a bit. And the reason why there's no reason to have a bigger area is because we have four customers. And once we need to expand, we'll expand. But right now, we don't have to. And I guess what I could do is just do something like that. I don't, it doesn't really matter. Because for the first three days, until we, well, no, not the first three days. Until we get a, a something to research, we're going to roll just like this. So this is my setup. This does have three tables. Uh, I can't really... Where's the door? Isn't the door here? The door is here, so I don't know if it'll let me do this. Can I turn this one off and then add a table? I don't know if it'll let me do it like that. Uh, oh, it does. Okay, good. Now I'm just going to turn. Oh, bring the sink back here. Turn these. Uh, actually, I wanted to turn that off. That can go. There we go. Whoops. No, I did it again. <laughs> I did it again. There we go. All right. Now we're now we're set up. Jeez. Okay. So stakes are pretty straightforward. Um, yeah. It, it's. Pretty straightforward. We're gonna call everybody in. One, two, three. So we have one double and we should have two singles coming in. And you don't need much space when you do stakes. As I said before, everything's to order. So there's no point to like preload too much stuff. I like to preload a little bit here. Uh, whichever one here finishes first, I'll serve that one up first. And we'll get to the medium one afterwards here, like that. We'll load up two more steaks, and we'll see once. All right, so they want both the uh, two of the messes, of course, you have to contend with. But again, are there, that, are there that many messes? No, of course not. Here we go. And that's the first day done already. So it's pretty, uh, you know, it's pretty straightforward here, <laughs> basically, right, guys? Um, but yeah, we're doing. Uh, it's it's not. It's you know, steak isn't. It's not difficult. It's just annoying in some sense because you can't really you can't automate it early on for it to make sense so we'll move this out of the way and see if we'll get lucky here i'm using the blame ontario seed and as you see there we did not get anything for the blueprint cabinet we didn't get a research desk and again, i'm using the blame the blame ont seed the blame ontario seed so i call because i i am the one that discovered it i guess um why well, i know i am but the point being is that i do it because of the layout like you have this huge open kitchen these hallways over here are basically for nothing. I mean, you could maybe wedge some kind of automation in there at some point. I don't know. But point being is we have nothing to research. So look at that. We're up to, we're up to eight customers now. That's a lot. I think I want to save. See, safety hobs are good. Actually, you know what? I want to go for, I want to go for tables. Just save tables. Now, safety hobs are good because they make less mess than the starter table, than these starter hobs. That's kind of the one benefit of them uh they don't they're really they really have the kind of the same action i'm waiting outside no everybody should be in okay that's five. Oh, we got big messes already i gotta be careful here oh these messes are killing me all right what do we got here that one go back on that one go back on oops not that served served uh, oh yeah that's the only, okay the only issue with steak as i mentioned before is I should almost move the steak thing somewhere else. I want to just grab it with a plate. 
that's not really what I want to do. And basically, you just kind of stake as a waiting game. Now, again, could you just do? Could you just do one? One danger hob? You could. See, when, when you have the ones where, the, where they want burn stakes, you have a lot more time to kind of fiddle around because it takes so long to get to that point. There's one. There's two. And now, you know, I, lo I love my instant ordering, but I don't think for steak I'd want to do instant ordering because, um, I don't know. I would or would or wouldn't. I don't really know. I guess this wouldn't think it makes sense compared to other dishes, but you never know. You never know, right? All right, day two in the books. Alrighty, now we could get a blueprint desk. Or, yeah, blueprint, a research desk, excuse me. Now, the one thing I do like about this map, you see where the door is at the bottom? You see where my mouse is here? I like the doors there because the game, like the round doesn't end until the customers go all the way over. You see where my mouse is on the left, bottom left. Until the customers get to this point, the game, the day doesn't end. So you have like basically maybe two seconds here from when the last customers walk out until they get to the end. That counts as time that you can use for things. Alrighty. Now, I don't actually think I have a stake for, oh, same, give me a, oh my gosh, wow. Uh, this is not good, guys. Uh, Cause I wanted to maybe get metal tables. But I think what I want to do, ooh, wow. You know what? Let's do a reroll. I'm going to save that other dining table just to save it. Let's do, I mean, I hate doing rerolls this early, but I want to see if we can reroll to get a research desk. Maybe we'll get lucky. Ooh, we got a coffee table. Not the greatest thing in the world, but it does have a purpose, obviously. Uh, the floor mats might actually be a better choice here, but I think I'm going to buy the coffee table because what that allows me to do is that will allow me. I'm going to actually put it over here. Now, some people say, oh, stick it way up in the corner so you have to walk for it. Yeah, but it doesn't, it doesn't exactly work like that. So, I mean, in the sense of it not uh, having patience problems or patient issues. See, so the thing problem here is if I have this here, I always end up grabbing the plate. So I wonder if I should swap it like that. Um, but I like having it at the top, so I think I'll just leave, let's leave it how it was and just um, Maybe do it like that. It's a bit easier to slide than this one. I like seeing it though You know what I mean? Now we're down to seven customers, which is very odd, but now we can probably call more. That's it. Double group, double group, double group. Okay Now plates may be an issue. I know we didn't buy any plates. Let's see. Is anybody going to the coffee table? If not, okay, they are so I gotta be a little careful there. They want two mediums, even though this is not a medium, this is a rare. Like the color that's coming up first, that's the color of a medium steak. A lot of rare steak. All right. Because what I'm hoping to get out of this run, guys, is I'm hoping we can get all the steak kinds. Like all the, uh, the thin steak, the thick steak. It really brings down the customer count, which is why I like it. And they're very, they're very interesting cards, too, because of how much... Oh, I guess I did call everybody, didn't I? So where's the last... Yeah, you did call everybody. Hmm, interesting. Yeah, because we had seven, right, 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 seven, seven, seven. I'm thinking we had more than seven, no. So we need a medium and a bird. Burns are the easiest ones, because you can't really... You can't really mess them up. Because once it gets to the burn stage, or the... Like, see how slow it goes? It goes so slow. And then here, we get one on for this guy. This patron. They're going to want a medium. <clears throat> Something to think is the only dish where you actually have to like wait around for like the right doneness. It's like, come on. Um, but hey, it works. It is what it is. It's fun how it is. Let's see what card we get. Maybe we'll get lucky. Uh, ooh, okay. Well, we're, we're going sides. Because the idea is if we franchise this and we keep rolling with the next franchise, um, you, you want to have low group counts. So now what we got to do, we have to back, oh, let me move this out of We have to back this up. Ooh, prep station's not bad, but the pro ooh, research, there we go, baby. But the thing is, though, if we have a prep station, what would we use it for? Nothing, right? Like, what would we use it for? I don't know. Okay, so I think the way I want to do this is we have six customers, so we're likely not going to need... All right, I want to do is I want to push some of these down. This can come here. This we're going to buy, of course. Now, the question is, what do we upgrade? Um, 
I wish we had a hob. I think I want us to upgrade the table. Because if we can start pushing metal tables, that may be a thing that we can keep getting sides. Now, the thing is with steak is that if you have both steak toppings, that's not a side. And you have, so you have, you have the, the toppings of mushroom. And you also have the sauces, the red wine juice sauce. And you also have the steak sauce, the mushroom steak sauce. Those don't count against metal tables because they're not a side. They're a topping. So I don't actually you know what I want to know. No, 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 what I'm going to do. I'm not going to do it that way. I want to try to push to get, I think we'll deal with sides. Yeah. What I want to do is I want to buy tables here. And I'm going to push everything back because we have enough money to buy another table. I think that's where I want to go with this run. And yeah, I'm just going to do it all from in here. It would have been nice to get another hob, but uh, we didn't get another hob. Now the door is here. Should I just move these a little bit? If I put, oh, I can't, oh yeah, I could do it like, uh, I could do it like that. Is that kind of weird? I don't think so, is it? And then there'd be a counter here, and then this table would be, yeah, I think that's, you know, let's just do it, um, let's do it like that, because that way I can fit two counters here. I think that would be fine. It's gonna reset everything, of course. Oh, actually, it did not. It did not. That's good. Okay, so what I'll do is I'll do this. So that means we can put the broccoli there. This. Oh shoot! I gotta. Go. Okay, never mind. I'm not gonna move all that around. I'll just run around this way. Uh, as if, as one thing with like the prep phase, I guess you'd call this like the prep phase. I wish you could just walk through. Like, wish you it'd almost be like a ghost mode where you could just walk through walls and stuff because it's just so tedious to have to run around. And I understand the reasoning for it. Um, I just find it. I guess I could go through here. I just find it a little bit annoying because it doesn't add anything for having to run around. Now, again, I don't know how, if that's difficult to code, you know what I mean? So maybe that's why uh, it's not done like that. I don't really know. All right, so I think we'll do the stakes here now. And yeah, I should do it like that. And then what I'll do is the broccoli and the pots will go here. Should we buy more plates? Because this would be the time to buy plates if we're gonna buy plates. Actually, the end, I'm not gonna buy plates, you know why? All right, so I don't need to, I can still sit here. This is fine, this is fine. Um, the Brock is fine here. I'm not gonna mess with this. Um, yeah, so we'll get the broccoli on right away. Again, we have six customers, so it's not like we have tons. I know some people, they like, they, they make it take forever for them to like, their prep days to last forever. It's like, ah, oh, come on, let's get, let's get it going here. Now, as long as I have the, oh, uh, we got a workstation, which is not what I wanted. All right, let's get a little bit of that on. Got a medium. I don't know we're near that yet. I guess I could probably get two going. No, because we only have six customers. And broccoli, I believe, has five. Five servings. So unless... I'm just going to call everybody else. Unless everybody wants broccoli, which they're not. We're fine here. Uh, let's see. We got this double, single, single. I can call the last group in because they can go to the dining. The uh, Oh, two doubles. Okay. Get the single. Oh, single wants a burn. Ugh, come on, buddy. Now, again, you can portion sides prior to um and you could give this to them now you don't have to put that on a plate like it could be separate uh, just a little bit of a tip there uh, what do you guys want medium and a burn Ugh. see only one broccoli so far so we're good to go with that there's a plate and here's a plate so yeah i guess what i'm saying when i said about the bro um the the steaks being difficult in the sense that you can't i use the term preload tables or like, you know, if I just have meat pie, I know they're going to want meat pie so I can preload the table. Meaning I could have one sitting on there already before I take their order. But with mistakes, you can't do that because, um, and also here's another tip. Now, I wish, I hope this is fixed. So you see the medium steak on the, on the plate on the counter. They're the ones that want the broccoli. This is the, this, I'm giving the raw or the rare one or whatever it is, the one with the broccoli. Watch what happens. They take it anyway. Because it doesn't matter where you give the side to, just because, just as how it is, is like you can serve the main dishes and then serve the side afterwards or before. I, I would like it. I would like it to be set up where you have to serve the the side on the plate that they request. Because if you do it with like toppings or steak sauce or beans, you have to do it as what they ask. You can't just do whatever you want. It won't. It won't, won't work. All right, so workstation is pointless now. Do we? You know what I'm gonna do? I think I think I want to do I upgrade a hob. So we either want to upgrade either I either want to upgrade a hob or upgrade a sink. Just get a little bit faster of a sink. Now again, I could just buy the sink. 
Um, maybe I'll just buy the sink because this is a 1x speed sink. Uh, it doesn't say it is, but it is, obviously, um, because this one here is going to say it is the starter sink, which is slower. I think the starter sink is 0.75 speed. The regular sink is 0.1. Now, again, could I have upgraded to a power sink? Yes. Do I think I'm going to need a power sink? I don't think so. But I think we're just going to get rolling here. Um, another coffee table would be great. Get the Brock on eight customers, so not a big deal. Yeah, we're basically just going to keep on rolling here. I want to get my research done, and then we'll call everybody. Well, not everybody, because we have eight customers, I think it was today. Give us a... So Safety Hop is fun. Um, I'm banking on getting a, another side somewhere. And again, you can portion off of a hob if that's something that you want to need to do. You can portion off of a hob. I think the safety hob will be good, um, mainly just oops, mainly because uh, it doesn't have as much of a mess to it as the uh, the other hobs do. That's everybody then. Get this one out. There we go. But today's gonna be deco day. Just keep that in mind. Okay, the sink is a bit faster, as you can tell. All right, let's get this steak on. This steak on. Let's see what these guys want. Oh. Both rares. Ooh, that's a big old mess. I gotta be careful of that. Again, this is this is what the starter hubs do. They make a gigantic mess. And look how long it takes to clean this. One, two, three, four. It's like literally six seconds to clean these giant messes. And, and uh, what the fault I had before is, as you can tell, we don't have danger. Or excuse me, we don't we don't have um, metal cables, so you don't have to worry about. Um, patience as much that's what I was getting at because metal tables if you remember metal tables are 50 percent 50 percent less patience which is a huge number by the way like 50 percent because they, they used to be 25 percent and they also never used to combine with themselves now they do combine which I I think before they combined they were a little bit op op overpowered because you could line up 10 of them in a row and they wouldn't combine with each other now I understand why they do combine and it does make sense it does make sense I like that change Alrighty, so exclusive is the way I go here. Excuse me, the way I go here is exclusive. I think we have, <coughs> excuse me, one more one more day we can get through, and then um, then we'll see what we get. <coughs> excuse me, I'm not one to decorate anything, so I'm still not going to decorate unless we get. Uh, oh, okay, we got the flower. So this is be one twenty because because if if you buy these, each diamond is worth thirty. If you buy this, each diamond is worth thirty three. But I don't really don't want to. Hmm. Oh, do we have this? Do we need to buy the safety hub? We can just sit on it until next. Well, you know what? No, 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 no. I want to buy it. I want to buy it because of the. Okay, hold on a second. So if I buy this, this is worth sixty, which means we're not going to have enough to buy this. So I think what I'll do is just buy the buy this. Just stick it up here. It doesn't matter where these are. These decorations like that you put down are not room specific. Plants and paintings are, and, and like. Uh, display stands are, are room specific these decorations are not they are restaurant specific which you can tell when I put it down even though it's not in the room where the tables are it gives you the buff anyway now I can't buy another one I can't buy anything because I don't have enough money now I could buy a rug but ah uh, yeah that's something I guess kick my sucks I like the extra money one but it's fine because if we get to franchise this that means that we can go with exclusive going forward so uh, we have seven customers we actually have that extra sink, which might come in handy. And we can might, might as well call everybody. Now again, I can't see everybody wanting broccoli, so I'm not gonna rush to make two pots of broccoli. It doesn't really matter, you know. And there you go, done already. All right, you want a little bit of this, and you're gonna want a little bit of this. Look at that. So we've got a burn going. Yeah, I think I'll I'll take the safety hub. Uh, oh, another one that's a single hub. Oh, shoot, I messed that one up. Darn it all. This is how when you try to rush it a little bit too much. I'm trying to get this one out. Someone will buy it before that. I don't, maybe not, but someone someone may wear it. Let's do it burned. <laughs> Good burned ones. Alright, what do we got here? We got a burn, and we got a... Another burn, jeez. Oh my gosh, this mess on here is killing me right now. See that mess? So you can skirt around the mess. Like if you stay to this side, you can skirt around it. But oh, I'm gonna miss. I'm gonna miss this. Nope, I got it. 
I'm just gonna do this. Yeah. Oh, I had this one made already. Why did I do that? That was so silly. That's yeah, okay. Maybe these guys will want it. Yeah, the message, because this is like, look how long it takes me to do this. So I'm just gonna ignore it. All right, we got two, two rares. Perfect. See, you can skirt the mess by going, oh, not there, around like that. There you go. All right, next day. Alrighty, after today we get another card. Now, <sighs> mash would be fine. I want to try to take sides. If, I hope we get a sauce, actually. Give us, like, the wine sauce or something. I'd be happy with that. Or any of the sauces, really. It doesn't matter. Each one requires a, a double cook anyway. Ooh. So... This is this adds a little bit now because chips you actually have to chop the potato and then cook them to order. But personalized waiting though at day seven, like we have many more days. And say we end up getting, I wish we would have gotten more of the steak cards, uh, like the thin steak and then the thick steak. I wish we would have gotten, wish we would have got those or gotten those. But uh, dang, I don't actually know here. Personalized waiting is not bad, but again with steak, it's. As soon as you start on cooking, you almost have to wait for them. Hmm. You almost have to wait for them to choose and change the order before you cook it. So it could take a while. Chips, again, drops our groups down. It's at 15%. It'll probably drop our groups down to six. I don't know. It's, um, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, honestly. But you know what I'm going to do? We're going to end the episode here, guys. And I want you guys to leave in the comments what you would choose what you would choose and then also what you think I will choose because sometimes everybody's different so some of you guys may say take personalized waiting I don't want to deal with another side I don't have metal tables which you're right we kind of gave up on metal tables and guess what now we're getting all the sides or you can say go chips gonna bring your groups down a bit the chips aren't that hard to make not everybody's gonna want chips and that's true as well we have the safety hop right but again we don't have a grabber we don't have a mixer we don't have anything that would help us automate chips as of yet so, so leave it in the comment below about what you would choose and then what you think I would choose based on my gameplay. You know how I play and how the run's going. So yeah, leave it in the comments below. If you're new to the channel, please consider leaving me a subscribe. It would really be helpful. And uh, yeah, like and comment the video. It would also be quite helpful with the algorithms to get everything noticed uh, in the search bar on YouTube. So thank you so much and I'll catch you guys next time. Take care now.